Here I am at the back of Penrith Lakes. There's fishermen over there, but there's a boom gate. And the boom gate's shut, and you've got to have a code to get in. So I don't know how to get in there. That sucks. Anyway, I'm looking over here and I can see a couple of giant carp, so I'm going to catch one of them while I'm here. But there's, yeah, they're fishing over there, so they're allowed in. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, they have a boom gate shut with a code for a restaurant in there and a code for something else. And unfortunately, I don't have those codes. There's no signs here anywhere saying not allowed in here to fish. So I pulled up just to see if I could see Eric, which I can over there, and then I seen all these big carp. First snake for the year. Big, big black snake there. Hey, he just disappeared into that. Oh, he's real flighty too. We'll leave him alone, eh? Someone was commenting the other day, is there many snakes? And it's like, yes. That's about a four or five foot long black snake just sitting there in that grass. So you just gotta watch out for him. All good bass holes have black snakes. I'll stuff that walk along that edge for me because I'm just gonna try and stalk that carp. This bass around maybe on this weed edge though. He's a big snake. The carp might be just there. Oh, oh that was a big bass. Whoa! I was about to go for that carp. That's a 40 plus centimetre bass, Sam. Snakes, bass, what else do you want? I was first cast into the weed edge, so... I should go get a little bread and butter or see what's really in here. One cast for one giant bass. I just don't know what the laws are on this lake. There's no signage anywhere. There's a tail of a carp sticking out. I, I, oh, I've got to have a go at him. Let's catch this carp. How did he disappear? Like, oh no, there he is. Look at that, he's, it's already in his mouth. Hungry fish. Get up here, mate. Now I've seen that bass, I ain't got time for you. <laughs> Look at him. Stay there, stay there. Yeah, I don't have a clue what the rules are to this lake. There's no signage. And I only crawled around here to see if I could see them fishing in Penrith Lakes, which they are. So. There's gazillions of them in here. Oh, what was that? Might have been a eel. Didn't feel like a carp or bass, but it just started running right through the reeds. It's 
Still want to get into Penner Flakes. Hmm. All right, snakes. Think about these black snakes that are like the water doggies. Where you find one, sunning, he'll uh, you'll see him there all the time. Now he's in that grass across there. So I'm just going to make a wide berth. Make sure he hasn't got a little mate. Oh, there. See, there's one there. Red belly black snake. It's a smaller one, so there's at least two in here. Big turtle. I'm used to little long necks. Stuck his head out, seen it. I don't want to catch him, I just want to see who was going to follow the lure. I think I'm going to have to put a beetle spin on. There's a stack of snakes here. Oh, as you can see, the place is riddled in black snakes. But I need to know if that was a big old bass or a carp that chased this lure up. So, you know, walk like thunder, eh? You guys will hear us. Whoa, number three. There's another one. Jeez. Just head out waiting. That was a little tiny one. Uh, I'm going to go. I just want to know if that's a bass. Uh, there's three black snakes just in that bit of grass there, and all I want to do is fish that corner. I knew there'd be one there. He's a small one, but he was flattened out waiting for me. There must be stacks around here. Right. You gotta get out one more time. It's one of those things with wildlife. If, like, think if you don't want to hurt them, they don't want to hurt you. But they have the potential to hurt you. Oh, mate. Oh, I haven't. There could be good snakes just here, but. We have a rule of thumb, if we tread on three black snakes in a day, we go home. Alright, I only want two or three casts there and that'll be it. Looks like I'm never going to know whether that was a giant bass or a giant carp. At first thoughts, I thought it was a bass. But I haven't, I've done two lure switches and haven't got one out of it, so I'm going to give it away. Now the only trouble is I've got to walk back through all those snakes. I'm thinking I might walk the water's edge. I know they get in that brown pine leaves, but I think, and the bigger one's down there too, but I think I'm safer doing that than, I don't know, we'll see how we go. My biggest fear is if they, they shoot into the water then they go right past me. They should be more up on that bank in the sun though, so I'm hoping that the real big one was just here somewhere. Have a very healthy respect for these snakes. There's probably 10 of them in there.
Oh, well, that's a bummer. I actually was really excited about having that flick at Penrith Lakes. And uh, I'll have to find out what the go is, but you must have to get a, a gate code to get in there now, even on the Tuesday. Because I did see there was guys fishing in there, I just couldn't get in. I've seen the comments pop up last night on the video I did yesterday. And the answer to one of them is yes, the stacks of snakes. <laughs>